This is Brandon Cooney with Frederick Keys, and here's 10 questions on Royals Hangout. Brandon, what's your favorite song to enter the bullpen from? Uh, I'm a big Little Wayne fan, so it'd probably be Fireman. A little old school. Alright, if you could add one more pitch to your arsenal already, which pitch would you add? You know, I got three down, working on a changeup, so it would help me a lot with lefties. So I'm really, I'm really trying to get the changeup, so I don't have to say that. Alright, bases loaded, full count. Yeah. Bottom of the ninth. 3-2 yeah, count. Which pitch are you going to and why? I'm going with a fastball just because I'm really aggressive in the zone. I like to challenge hitters and you know I have to trust my stuff and I feel like my fastballs really help me to get to where I am. Which Frederick Key would win a world's strongest man competition? Joe Mahoney. He's a, he's a very, very large man. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the toughest hitter you've ever faced? Scott Spezia. I saw him when I was in college. We played the uh, St. Louis Cardinals in an exhibition and uh, threw a fastball by him. And then I threw the exact same pitch and he crushed it off the wall. Next time, threw him a good curveball. He took. I doubled up again, crushed it off the wall. So <laughs> I didn't really figure him out. <laughs> All right, if Denny Hawking stepped up to the plate against you, how would he fare against you? Uh, I don't know, you know, Denny's been out of his game, so I'd have to say I'd fare well. <laughs> he could strike him out? Uh, maybe. He's got good He's got good emergency hands, so I'd probably bust him in, maybe see if I get a chopper back to myself. Alright, what goals do you have for this season? Well, I'd like to, you know, I just want to stay consistent. I don't want to have, you know, be up and down and up and down. I want to have all my pitches. And, you know, I'd like to say about three ERA and a good opportunity to save ratio. So, I mean, I don't really set numbers. What's a typical off day like for you? Off day? Sleep in, probably till about 11. Try to stay low key, maybe go do some golfing. Maybe I'll go to the mall. Nothing too crazy. Why is FAU such a, such a powerhouse for, for Orioles talents? <sighs> you know, we have a, um, one of our Eastern cross checkers is an FAU alum. So, a lot of the, a lot of the teams that go to scout in South Florida, they end up at Miami and you know they'll go to the East Coast or the West Coast and they'll go see Florida State, Florida. So the people that see us they kind of just let us slip through. Like because they're I'd say like it's kind of like a mid major baseball school. So you know I don't know. I, I just feel like it's just one of those one of those things that happen. Alright and finally if Brett Bordis were not a baseball player, what would Brett Bordis be doing? If Brett Bordis wasn't a baseball player I feel like he would be a motivational spokesperson. Get on stage and you know make people people feel good about themselves. He's the guy that picks me up. If I have a bad day, he's always gonna make me smile, make me feel better about what's happening. So you know, Brett's a good guy. He's my roommate on the road. So I guess that. <laughs>